At Walmart, I bought three boxes of, these are the Puffs Plus Lotion, which are the ones I like, and these are the uh, the square boxes. Uh, they take up less room than the, the longer boxes. So uh, I bought three of those. And then I bought some Tostitos Scoops. I bought a loaf of bread. Um, I bought some Clorox wipes. And they somebody said that uh, their store still doesn't have wipes. Uh, our Walmart has tons. So they had probably, I don't know, 40 other containers of these. But we're only allowed to buy one at a time. So I buy one every single time I go in and I see them. I buy a container of wipes. And then I bought some Quilted Northern Toilet Paper. At Walmart, I bought a six pack of Charmin Ultra Soft. I had a coupon. And then we needed some garbage bags. These are the uh, Glad Force Flex Plus with uh, Gain for Breeze. And then I had a coupon for Tide Pods, so I bought those. Um, bought some uh, Kind Healthy Grains. I still haven't seen the the big family size bag anywhere else except for Target. This is the Peanut Butter Clusters. Uh, we bought some creamer for our coffee. And then I bought one four package of uh, vanilla Dan and Light and Fit yogurt at Walmart. And then at Kroger, this is from Kroger, uh, they only had two left, so I bought the last two that they had of the vanilla. Uh, we had a coupon, Kevin had a coupon on his phone for the Nature Valley Crunchy granola bars. I bought the peanut butter. Um, I had a coupon for Tide Pods. Uh, so. It was really good because I had a coupon for $3 and then Kevin had a coupon for $3 on his phone. So we got $6 off of this. I think it was like five bucks for that whole thing. Yeah, it was, yeah, it was wonderful. And then they actually had uh, big containers of wipes. Uh, and actually it didn't say there was a limit, but I just got one because I'm that's what I'm used to doing. Uh, Kevin bought two Diet Dr. Peppers two diet a and w's and then we bought five waters uh they had an incredible deal these were only a dollar what were they a dollar ninety nine uh when you and you bought five you could buy up to five for a dollar ninety nine for 32 bottles so we couldn't pass up that deal at meyer we bought these stouffer's uh chicken pot pie bites bacon and white cheddar mac bites Classic lasagna bites and mac and cheese bites. We will be trying these on this channel because they're not microwavable. You have to use the oven, so Kevin can't try them on his lunchtime review. Also on this channel, we're going to be trying the Pioneer Woman toasted sausage ravioli with marinara, goat cheese bites with marinara, and zucchini chips with sweet and sour sauce. Uh, we'll be trying these on my channel as well. Frank's Red Hot Buffalo Boneless Chicken Bites. Uh, Kevin will be trying these on his Lunchtime Review channel. These are Tost Totino's Pizza Stuffers and the Triple Cheese. Also on his Lunchtime Review channel, he'll be trying the Michelina's Taco Bites. The Banquet Mega Bowls Sesame Chicken Lo Mein and the Kung Pao Chicken. Uh, I bought two cans of pumpkin. And I bought uh, some sweetened condensed milk. At World Market, I bought this Nestle Peppermint Crisp Milk Chocolate Bar. It just sounds really good, so we'll review that. And then I bought these, they finally got their Halloween stuff in. So I bought these vintage uh, paper things that you, you hang up. So this is a jointed tango witch and cat. See, so you have a, a cat over here and then a witch over here, you get two things. And then in this bag, you get three things. These are tissue dancers. You get a witch and a skeleton and a cat. And then this one is a jointed goblin. And it's just one big goblin. You can see in the picture there. And then um, we will be reviewing these before Christmas. These are like 12 copies of Christmas. Every day you get a different flavor of coffee, so we will go ahead and review these so that you can see if it's worth the money. Also, I'm very, very excited about this. This is a Barbie Build Your Own Cookie Dream House. We will be uh, putting this, attempting to put this together before Christmas so you can see how hard it is. And then we bought the uh, Joe and Seth's gourmet popcorn advent calendar now we have tried some joe and seth's if we happen to get 
a flavor uh, that we have gotten uh, that we've tried in the past it's okay we're gonna try it anyway so we're gonna be opening that before Christmas so that you can tell what you get and if it's worth your money also at World Market um, Kevin chose this uh, grandma grandma what? Horner's eight Horner's pecan pie filling and this um, pumpkin pie filling, caramel maple mm -hmm. pumpkin pie filling. They also had this, um, um, no, oh, no, this one, this one, yeah, was in the Halloween section. It's called Flying Cauldron Butterscotch Beer. Non, it's non-alcoholic too. Flavored beer. Yeah, and so to try with that, we bought this uh, Fentiman's ginger beer and uh, Curiosity Cola. Um, then lastly at World Market, I bought these figures, which I love figures like this um, to put like on the dining room table or something like that. And you can order these online. Uh, we are just now getting this stuff in our World Market though. She said they got, what'd she say? They got a, a got all the stuff in at one time. I love the moon on that, the cat. And then you have a pumpkin. So you have an owl, a cat, and a pumpkin. And then at Home Goods, um, we bought this Planet Popcorn. This is uh, kettle caramel, uh, caramel kettle mix and just kettle corn. And then Kevin spotted these. They hadn't even opened up the um, package yet. We ripped open the package and got out the mask we wanted. Um, these are my masks. We bought the Disney cloth mask for Amelia. And you get three princesses on this one and then Belle and then there's a bunch of pictures on this one and you can see what they look like and then we got uh Kevin picked out the Mandalorian ones and look he's eating the frog uh for Gavin and I think he'll like having a choice and so will Amelia and then we found these Bubba snack mixes they had the hickory smoked barbecue the righteous ranch and the savory original I bought two pillows. I absolutely love these. They are very, very nice quality pillows. They're um, just incredibly nice. Uh, but I chose this one. And then I chose this one with the flags. And it's like a, a tapestry. That's, that's how nice that is. Very nice. And then lastly, I picked out this little pumpkin man. Um, I just love him. The only thing that could make him any cuter is if he had a pair of glasses on. Mm. But I love him. I think he's adorable. At Marshall's, we bought this Trayvon Primo. These are wafer cubes. So we have the strawberry, the hazelnut, and the chocolate. And then we bought this uh, Cocoa Therapy. We've had this brand before, but we haven't had these. They're dark chocolate cups, milk chocolate cups. Uh, well dark chocolate almond butter cups and then this is milk chocolate peanut butter cups this is dark chocolate peanut butter cups these are the dark chocolate covered blueberries and then we have some belgian boys uh, these are raspberry cookie tarts these are cookie uh, bars and then these are uh, choco caramel cookie tarts and then at aldi do you want to start back here? At Aldi, we bought the Millville Harvest Granola and the Pumpkin Spice Granola. I bought the uh, Benton's Cookie Thins. These are the Apple Crumble, and then these look really good. They're Pumpkin Spice Flavored Cream Cookies. And then these are the Chakura Legends, and there's one, two, three, four, five, seven different candy bars in here. I actually bought two of them because I wanted to make sure we got at least one of each, and whatever we don't need, I can just put in the, in the um, candy dish. Um, I bought these Simply Nature Cookies. They're soft-baked cookies. We have orange cranberry walnut, pumpkin spice, chocolate chip, and oatmeal raisin. Um, I found the Bake Shop Fluffer Nutter, which I cannot wait to try, and the Chocolate Brownie Cookies. And then I found some Apple Cider Cookies and some Pumpkin Pie Cookies. Honestly, we may have had those in the past. I'll have to look them up and see. If we have, I'll just, we'll just enjoy them. Uh, we uh, bought this Apple Strudel and this Apple Frangipan Tart. And this is a Fruits of the Forest Strudel. Then I found this specially selected salted caramel cheesecake. 
Um, I have a Bake Shop Bakery brown butter pecan cheesecake and a pumpkin swirl cheesecake. I have these Brecky Overnight Oats. Uh, this one, let's see, they were on the side, I think, what they were. This is Vanilla Cinnamon. This one is uh, Banana and Maple Brown Sugar. And then this one is Strawberry. And then for Kevin's, all the rest of this is for Kevin's Lunchtime Review Channel. So if you're interested, you'll have to hop on over there and he'll be reviewing these. He got some pimento cheese. He's going to try the zesty jalapeno and the original. He'll do those in the same video and compare them. And then he bought the General Tso's chicken bowl and the Szechuan, Szechuan uh, lo mein chicken bowl. He bought the Brimmer Bistro grilled cheese tomato soup, a whole and simple teriyaki sriracha bowl, and a roasted hatch chili chicken burrito bowl. He bought the Brimmer ham and cheese hot stuffed sandwiches, some uh, Kessa Mamita beef and bean burritos and beef and cheese burritos, and lastly, some Kesa Mamita chicken and cheese taquitos and beef taquitos. At Walmart, I bought some Intamin's Little Bites. These are the party cake muffins for uh, Gavin and Amelia. And I bought some penne pasta, uh, 18 large white eggs, <laughs> um, an onion, and two green peppers. I bought some uh, two packages of uh, ch chicken breast. They're boneless, skinless chicken breasts. Um, I bought these are John Souls Foods, and I figured I would try them. I, I've never tried them before. I'm not going to do a review of them, but um, I might film when I eat them, and that way I can talk about them maybe. Uh, this is the rotisserie season, and then I figured I would try the chicken fajitas too, because um, they used to sell a kind in a green bag. I forget what brand it was back there, and it was chicken fajitas, and it was really good, but it wasn't this brand. Anyway. I bought those, and then I bought two bags of shredded iceberg lettuce. I bought a bang key lime pie and a radical uh, redactyl. No, radical skedactyl. Skedactyl. Um, I don't know what that means. Um, this is uh, some cheese, some medium cheddar cheese. Uh, these are banana peppers, just the great value banana peppers. I bought some Bold House Farms Classic Ranch uh, dressing. Uh, some of the new trolley sourbrook crawlers. These are the fruit punch variety. I bought a big jar of the Pace Chunky Picante Sauce. This is medium. Um, I bought, uh, we have a couple of little things to give to Gavin. So I wanted to just pick out something little to give to Amelia as well. And they had these little dolls. They were only like $2.50 each or something in the toy department. And they have tons to choose from. They have some with blue hair. And anyway, I just bought those two for her. Um, I bought a gallon of milk. And then some chips. Uh, this is nacho cheese Doritos Cool Ranch. And then Cheetos Puffs and uh, Crunchy Cheetos. And then we bought some Wyman cooktop uh, cleaner for the stove, some Clorox wipes, because we always pick one of those up when we see them, and some light bulbs. We went to Kroger, and I just got three little things at Kroger. I bought uh, a bunch of celery, and I bought some uh, traditional uh, pie crust. They had these. They had a deep dish. They also had some, I want to say they were like gluten-free or something. They were really, really expensive. They were like six dollars but anyway regular pie crust and then i bought some uh, yogurt and i already had some in the refrigerator so i didn't need much so i just bought one container at walmart we bought a loaf of bread some light mayonnaise which i didn't look at the calories on that 35 okay well the reason I, I don't know why i'm thinking to do that now um kroger if you buy the kroger light mayonnaise it's more calories it's like Instead of 35 calories, it's like 50 calories or something. So it's like, well, why would I do that? So anyway, uh, great value light mayonnaise. Uh, Kevin wanted to get some more ibuprofen. So we just buy the Walmart brand, the Equate. Um, I bought some more hairspray. And we bought some more toilet paper.